guys, it's Hannah and this is Bookworms Talk. And today I'm going to do the Book Tower Challenge. You guys asked me to do this, you challenged me, challenge is accepted. I'm kind of nervous for this one because I watched um, Reagan's at Prue's Project. I think I'm going to fail and I feel like I'm going to drop books. Hopefully that won't be the case. I set up a chair to where stacking will hopefully occur and less dropping will occur. I'm sure my neighbor will appreciate that. But, um, so I'm going to set up a timer. I guess I should, yeah, tell you how this works, right? That's kind of customary. What I'm going to have to do is go through 20 questions that I wrote out on a sheet of paper. I tried not to really think about it, just wrote them down, um, under a minute and a half. So like things that they require of, like a certain color of, on a cover or a, some, and you'll get the drift of this really quickly because I'll try to say them out loud unless panic just overtakes and it turns into like, <laughs> We'll find out. So I'm going to start the minute and a half timer. Oh yeah, and then after that, I'm going to have to alphabetize them. But I'll get explained to that when I get to that part. So we'll get there when we get there. Ooh, this is like the tin can challenge. I don't want to do it, I'm nervous. Okay, this is ugh, so reminiscent of the infinite book thing. Okay, okay, just, just press the timer. Just do it. We're doing this. And starting, okay. Uh, first book in a series, slammed. Uh, second book in a series, The Walking Disaster. Book with blue on the cover, Fault in Our Stars, title seven, seven letters. Um, 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 ah, yeah, okay. Um, book I've never read, uh, Stranger, okay. Uh, book with Sky, Hopeless. Um, author, same. No one has ages. I'm not going to look for that. A classic. Uh, classic. Um, non. School book. School book. Okay. Um, four plus colors on the spine. Pros, uh, unteachable. Um, New York Times. Maybe someday. I know that one. Okay. Um, smallest book I own. Okay. I wrote this for you. Um, smallest er, next book I bought. I just bought that one. Um, book with a face on it, losing hope, um, 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 a spinoff, where's bad things, where's bad things, where's bad things, where's ah, bad things, don't fall, um, um, book published 10 years ago, um, where is it, oh, Jane Eyre, um, uh, the sequel coming out next year, oh shit, that's a third, does that count, um, uh, I think this one does, I think it does, I think it does. Um, sure. <sighs> Is that bad that I'm out of breath? Okay, so I got to 17 out of 20. That's good. Okay, so now. <gasps> that was scary. My heart just raised more from that than any of that. So then I just have a minute to put them in alphabetical order. I'm kind of, I think I'm going to do worse with this. Hi, hello, I'd like to welcome you to the worst lighting up ever experienced. My phone is all the way up there. Oh, okay, success. This is gonna happen on the ground. The purpose might have been so you could actually see this happening, but I don't want to fall. Okay, so, start. That's it. Okay, so I have, I'll, I'll prove you, I'll prove you. See that going on? Those are two piles, beginning, then the next one. Okay, so I'm a little proud about that. I was like, oh, I totally got the last stack fucked up because I just kind of haphazardly was just like focusing on that. Yeah, oh, how many points did I get? Oh, I guess I should check to make sure that I did all my things correctly. Okay, so I said first in a series, I said, I said that was slam. Second in a series, I said was 
um, Walking Disaster. That is the second. Okay, that's good. Book with blue on the cover. I said uh, Fault in Our Stars. Three, seven letters long. I think I said red pill for that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The amount of time that took me to count was really just, I'm ashamed. Okay, so I, I'm good with that. A book I've never read. What one was that? Oh, that was The Stranger. Book with sky on the cover. That was totally hopeless. I know that one. And there's sky on it, sea sky. And her name is Sky, so that's just extra points. I didn't get um, author with the first letter of name. I didn't do that. I don't think there is any whose name starts with an H. I only know a bunch of last name H's. I didn't get that one. Classic. Ooh, I knew that one. That one's The Awakening, because Megan keeps wanting me to read it. So I have this one. So seven points, a nonfiction. Oh, that was my school book. Art History 2. The choice of school, I'm so glad my backpack was right there. Um, four plus covers on the spine. Ooh, that was the one I wasn't sure about. I said, uh, unteachable. Okay, so, blue, purple, pink, yellow, and then red. Oh, hey, that's more! Okay, that, that counts, that counts. I was, I was like, I don't know, I see colors, let's go for it. So nine points, New York Times plus, oh, that was so slim. No, that wasn't, I already did slam. Oh, that was the maybe someday. Does it say New York Times bestselling author? Or, yeah? Did it have to be bestseller or bestselling author? Shit. I think I, t I don't think I can give myself that point. It has to be bestseller, not bestselling. Damn it. Okay, yeah, I can't give myself that point. Smallest in size. Ooh, that was, um, I wrote this for you. Please find this. Got it. Latest book that I bought. Uh, The Bronze Horseman. Book with a face on it, losing hope. Then a spinoff book, that was Bad Things, which is a spinoff of the Up in the Air series. A book published 10 years ago was Jane Eyre, much more than 10 years ago. And a book with a sequel coming out next year. I have to Google this, because I don't know. But I guessed Jane's Melody, because I heard it, I mean, he got picked up by um, a publishing house and stuff, so I'm assuming that a sequel will be made, so let's find out. Success! Yeah, there's gonna be Melody's Harmony. Or, yeah, James Harmony. I'm Melody's Harmony. <laughs> so I get points. And that is as far as I got. So let's look up, let's count up the points. I got 15 points. And I only got 17 of the questions done, so I, th I think that's pretty good. I only messed up twice. That's, that's not too bad. <laughs> So I will see you guys later next time on Bookworms Talk, and I hope that you liked this and enjoyed watching me scramble around like a chicken with my head cut off. Um, yeah, there's really not much more to it. So uh, check out my prior book tag challenge -y stuff. I've done a couple of these. I don't do these super often, so if there are any of them that you would like me to do, then let me know. I mean, in the past, I have done Mary Kiss Cliff, um, and I've also done the Infinite books. It's like where you say the titles as fast as you can, like off of memory. And I feel like I've done like another one, but I just, I can't seem to remember like 25 bookish things about me, something like that. I don't know. I don't do tags very often, but if you would like me to do more of them, then challenge me because I just, I can't not accept a challenge. I'm a very competitive person, so I will do it. So I'll see you guys later next time on Bookworm Stock. Bye.